Good morning. I woke up. I feel fabulous. I feel rested. I prayed. I got in my word. Awesome. So today I think I am going to cook a turkey, right? So I remember a couple of months ago, my church, Grace Be Unto You, have a turkey get giveaway. We gave away like a hundred turkeys and like a hundred not 100, but like 60 hens or chickens. There were hens. Yeah, 60 hens. And they had uh, some left over, so I got a turkey. So it's been in my freezer for a little bit, so I'm going to cook that today. I have stuff in. So I'm just going to have like a mini Thanksgiving, you know, right in April. So I got to get rid of some of that stuff. So I got celery, I got carrots and onions. and So I'm going to cook a turkey and stuff and y'all <laughs> so while that's cooking i think i'm gonna do something really special for the kids i think i'm gonna cook uh what's that it's like loaded potatoes so i got some um <clears throat> leftover potatoes from carabas and i think i'm gonna cook those potatoes put some sour cream on them some chop up what is those things called scallions um some shredded cheese, cheddar cheese. I think the kids are gonna love it. And then I have some Chipotle, little Chipotle steak. So I'm thinking I'm gonna put some steak in with that. So it's gonna be like steak and potatoes, sour cream cheese, and scallop onions on top. The kids are going to love it. So that might be their lunch. And the turkey and the stuff in this stuff will be for dinner. So right now what I'm doing is I'm getting ready to get on the computer and do some work. Um, I'm going to write, a, uh, you know, my book for about an hour. I'm going to review some things for my author's books, like um, get their books published. One of the girls, I'm working on her book, her book cover today. So I'm excited. I'm going to put out an awesome, beautiful book cover for her book. Um, and I'm excited. Ooh. So I finished uh, writing a chapter. And I just want to keep writing. I think I'm going to spend my day just writing. So both the babies are up. And I just kind of decided not to go anywhere today. You know, I just want to write, you know. It's like when the spirit of the scribal anointing is on me, I need to write because I can write for hours. And just get this stuff done. Amen. So I'm going to go in the kitchen now and I'm going to cook this turkey. And after I put the turkey in the oven... I am gonna come back and finish writing. Turkey say, Raya. Help me. Cock a doodle doo. What? Turkey say, Mont. Cock a doodle doo. Wow. You ready for the answer? Yeah. Gobble gobble. Turkey say, what? Gobble gobble. Gobble gobble. My 11 pound turkey out. This is my turkey, and I'm going to butter it up last. So this right here is, you know, poultry seasoning. So just kind of pour some poultry seasoning, and then, of course, I'm going to flip it, you know, but I can't hold you guys and season this turkey, flip the other side, you know. But I'm going to do that, all right? Then after you put your poultry seasoning, you put some, I like sage, but just... You know, kind of put this on here. You know, get your turkey. All right. You can never have enough black pepper. So just use some black pepper. And then, just use some salt. Just some salt. All right. So I'm gonna flip this turkey, season the other side, and then I'm gonna put butter on it. You like that? So, I got my oven set for 325. I'm gonna let this bird cook for about four and a half hours. It's low heat, low heat and long. That's how you make a bird soft. You know, my turkeys don't be dry. They be moist and juicy in the inside. And I don't have to use a bag. I, I like turkey bags, but I don't have to use it. So 325. And I'm going to let it cook for about four and a half hours. 
And this turkey is going to be falling off the bones. It's going to be juicy in the inside. My kids love it. All right. So that is the secret to a soft bird. Remember, low heat for a long time. And this meat is going to be falling off the bone, bones. Oh, I got my green onions chopped. Um, got some mashed potatoes loaded. Uh, well, they're not loaded yet. Mashed potatoes with skins on them. And let me show you what else I got. I got some chipotle steak. You know, some beef steak. So I'm getting ready to load everything. I got cheese and some sour cream. I'm loading the plates. So I'm going to get some um i loaded like some potatoes on the plate we're gonna load this right quick all right so we're gonna get our chipotle our steak we're gonna put some steak on top of it you know to take a few pieces of some steak kids are gonna love this all right hold it up for them all right, then we can take some cheese. I'm gonna get some cheese. Just gonna put some cheese on there. Then we're gonna get our sour cream. Some sour cream on top. getting our green onions so I'm gonna sprinkle a few green onions on top so now I'm gonna give it to my son and he's gonna taste test this then I'm gonna give it to my son to taste test let me go ahead and salt and pepper Said what? Oh my gosh. Steak. Yeah. Go get that fork off the stove. But I want you to taste it. Yes, come taste it. Taste it. Let me see you taste it. Tell me how it tastes. We're waiting on you. Wait. Before you pop before you play it, taste it. Come on, Ma. Let me see you taste it. Look at him. How it tastes. Good. It tastes good? Yes. Good. He loves it. You like mama's cooking? Yes. Good. Now he loves his tablet. He's like, I can't. You know, do anything. You know, I need to play my tablet. Good. I know it tastes delicious. So, he passed the mommy taste test. Oh. You see, it's a really easy recipe. Kids love it. You know, potatoes, steak, cheese, sour cream, green onions. You know, thumbs up, right? <laughs> so, I just got the phone with Babe. And we're talking everything's going good and we just watched um, we're, we're gonna watch a movie later that kids wanna watch a movie with me and try Moses good all right, I can't see you mom so both kids are eating seconds of the potatoes so it's Mariah she's eating seconds and this is her plate yes you like it you, you join it yes both the kids came and got me at the same time and said mommy you know, we want more mashed potatoes or more potatoes. Yeah, it was just me. Mama, you just came and got me? So he's eating. He loves it. Second plate. You know, he said he was happy. You happy? Yes. You like it. See, my kids eat way more than I eat. Ma, you want to watch a movie with me and Tron Moses later? Okay, good. You want to watch a movie together? All of us? Yes. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, 
like I told you guys before in a long distance relationship you got to put in the time so I am going to finish writing my second chapter today and then we're gonna we're gonna call Bay back and we're gonna watch a movie we're gonna watch like some kind of Christian movie um, and just some other kind of um, maybe like preaching right now I've been on this preacher I can't pronounce his name, so don't judge me. You know, Jenison Franklin, I, just, I think that's how you pronounce it. I love his teaching. I just listened to him the first time a couple of days ago. I was like, wow. He got me stare. I'm like, up here praising God, you know. So um, I want to watch a little bit of him today. And I'm right trying to get the second chapter, this ch chapter done. Because my babe is helping me with my book so which is good that's a good thing you know to work on something together as you know a couple I think that's really sweet so he called me today y'all he made me smile you know um it's a blessing to have someone to make you smile right that one person that can turn that frown into a smile so I like that ah <sighs> This turkey been in the oven for about, ooh, about almost four hours, but it's not done yet. You gotta wait till the juices run clear, so it's not done yet. So I'm gonna put it back in the oven for a few, about a couple of more hours, and let it cook. It's on 325, so maybe about seven o'clock will be done. So I just finished writing my second chapter. Written two chapters today. You know, babe understands. Say, hey, I'm trying to get this book out. So it's good to have someone that understands, you know? And I'm going to get something to drink. And I'm about to call Babe and me and the kids are going to watch something on television. You want to watch Brave Wilderness? Okay. Flash. And Flash? Okay. Flash. We'll ask Tron Moses what he wants to watch, okay? So you Can ask you him. TV? Yeah, you, you, you ask Tron Moses, okay? All right. So my son wants to watch the next episode of Flash. We all have our show, and it's called Flash. That's what we do. So the turkey is almost done, not quite, but I'm just basting it. You know, I wish I had, like, um, something bigger, but you got to use what you got, you know. So look at all the juice. You know, let's baste the turkey. And it's been cooking like all day, y'all. Slow heat. See, it's crispy on the outside, but the inside is extra juicy. So, I am just basting the turkey. Look, it makes its natural juices. Look at all this beautiful juice. Beautiful juice. You know, so. Looks good. So, I'm about to put it back in the oven. I think it'll be ready in about 30 minutes. So, yeah. And then I'll, y'all can watch me guys cut it and watch the kids taste them. You know? So easy. You know, I started off at 325 and cooked it for about four and a half hours. Then I cut it up to 350. So I'm 350 now. And it started really cooking. So I cut it to about 350. So, turkey's almost done. About 30 more minutes and it will be finished so finally the turkey is done I have um, been watching we watched like Kenneth E. Hagen we watched Flash mama what are you doing he's, he's having fun with an empty Hawaiian punch bottle or apple juice bottle throw it away so we watched Kenneth E. Hagen and we had a blast with that so I'm getting ready to cut the turkey, y'all. This is the final finished product. The turkey is crispy on the outside, but juicy in the inside. You know, just like a rotisserie chicken. You know, it's gonna be delicious. I'm about to cut it and show you guys. All right, so I'm getting ready to cut some turkey. And let me get a fork. And what do you want, Mark? Legs. You want a leg? Okay, so let's cut. Look how juicy this is. 
Oh, that looks good. Can you see the inside? You see that? Yes. Doesn't it look good? Yes. Let me see if I can cut some leg off. And the turkey's legs is still in that thing, so I'm going to take it off. It looks really juicy. You see how beautiful that looks? All right. All right. So I got this turkey. It's dripping with juice. That's Mariah's piece. Let me see if I get this leg off. So my mom saw takes the turkey leg. I know it's hot, ain't it? Not really. It's not really hot? How it tastes? Tastes good? Good. Good. So right, let's about to try some turkey. How it tastes? You like it? Good. So the turkey came out as a, uh, as a success. You know, pretty much all of it is moist. Let me show you, it's like falling apart and even in the, um, even in the uh, roast pan. So I'm getting ready to wrap it up and get, old, get on my face before the Lord. Yes. So this is the turkey. Daddy and Deuces. Deuces.